tribes located in the mountains. The culture is a little bit different. We call them Tuhama people. Khaled is taking me to the Asir Mountains, where I want to discover Saudi Arabia's past traditions. Assalamu alaikum. This is a male-dominated society, and these people are descendants of the very first Arabs, known for their fierce reputation as mountain warriors. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Hello. I wasn't expecting to be met by a lot of kids armed to the teeth with big daggers. <laughs> do, they, do they have the daggers all the time? The, the kids always? Yeah. They're going to milk the camels for us. He's keen to offer me a drink of camel milk, which I think is the, the local greeting. He's just milking it there. Do you like it? Fantastic. Yeah? Mm. Thank you, shukran. It's still warm. Frothy. It's the cappuccino. <laughs> cappuccino of the better. Kefir hal tayyib. Salam. Although they're as likely to be driving a 4x4 as often as a camel, these people do retain many of their traditions. It seems like the men are keen not to be outdone. <laughs> Saudi Arabia was once a land of warring tribes competing for power, and I want to know why my hosts have such a fierce legacy. <laughs> they stress the daggers represent prestige, strength and independence. Is this where they cook like goat? So is the head? Yeah. Nothing goes to waste? Nothing. So is the head a, d a delicacy or yeah. people like it? Yeah, yeah. Everything, brains, eyeballs. Even the hooves, there's yeah. the, the feet are going in as well. Yeah. Oh, now the stones go on top. Come on, guys. Thank you. They're very well mannered children. Wow. Look at this. Like. It's like a Roman feast, isn't it? Yeah, grapes and everything. Well, that really is delicious, really is. As you can see, the children, they left. Mm. They don't eat with the adults. No, no, no. no. Never. Yeah. We'll wait until we finish, mm. then they will come and eat. Right. <laughs> just going to have the leftovers. <laughs> you can't finish. I'm not going to finish this, don't worry. <laughs> no chance of that. The respect for the oldest, mm. apart from the traditions here. It's apparent that Saudi culture is ruled by a strict social code. Women and children segregated from the men, who, it seems, hold all the power. We say our goodbye.